Hi campers, Gary here from uh, Cross Camping Inflatable Tents Online. Just doing a quick video of the Robins Aero Yurt and I'm just going to let it down and then blow it back up. So it has multiple points where you can let the air out and it's a bit hard to sort of show you but there's a little button in there just pressing and then another one here now obviously one button will let the air out but I might as well press the others um, there's another one here and another one there um, so not all the air is going to be out of this when we blow it back up but uh, it's a bit of fun really if you were uh, packing this away I would get on top of there kneel on it and just squash towards the four and I'd open all four valves and just squash the air out of the tubes or just leave it five ten minutes if you've not got anything else to do but yeah you can just squash the air out through those uh, valves but anyway let's let's not mess about with that and obviously this is going to go up a little bit quicker than it normally would because I haven't let all the air out so I'm going to press the button again and put the cap back on in fact I don't need to do that I'll just press the button so the button is out okay so we've got an electric pump here just to make it a lot quicker and easier so just connect that in there i'm just going to put the phone down the camera uh hopefully you can still hear me i'm just connecting All right so i've just connected that valve and I'm just going to press the on button. Let's see what happens. So although it's got four points where you can let the air out and four points where you could inflate it from, you only really inflate it from one point. But those four points are so where you're parked or if you use an electric pump, uh, it might make it easier. But yes, normally I suppose you just use the hand pump from one of those points making sure the others are closed and closed means the little button is pressed out so what you do is you just let it fill up with air whether you're doing it by hand with the hand pump that comes with it which is a, a really good pump by the way the hand pump so yeah you can just let it sort of fill up and then at some point you want to go inside and just help it up a little bit the only slight problem is I can't even reach the top of it uh, when it's fully sort of up but it, it'll just pop into uh, position with me just going inside and giving it a bit of a lift in fact I might just leave it and see what happens now that pump we've got there will cut out when it gets to a certain pressure so if there's a kink in the tube like here it would cut out so let me just go inside and see what we can do okay, okay there you go so it's sort of up and now it's just finishing off getting to the right pressure um, that little lip does fold down and there's your framework all up there I've done other videos talking about it so you can look at it but this was just to show you how much fun and how easy so you turn up on site you'd lay it out you'd peg the shape of it and uh, yeah up it goes we leave the front door open when you're inflating tents uh, so you get air into the tent not into the tube but into the tent um, just makes it a bit easier 
and I say that pump will cut out in a second when it gets the right pressure but anyway that's Gary from inflatabletentsonline.co.uk uh, or you can come down to see us at Cross Camping where we've got loads of tents out the back just south of Cambridge. Cheers! <laughs>